and at our doorstep was a brand new baby bird. Good job, buddy. I got bows in the front, they're silver sparkles. He's gonna go grow big and strong and beautiful. So the good news is that we have an SPCA at the mall. So after going shoe shopping, you can come over and look at kitties. Good morning, everybody. Welcome to today's vlog. I'm not exactly sure where to begin on this one. This is an interesting one. So this morning, um, the kids were getting ready to go to school and they stepped outside of the door and at our doorstep was a baby, baby, brand new baby bird that Alice had brought us as a little gift. He was still breathing and alive and doing well. So Katie scooped him up and held him in her hands and we tried to like panic. We weren't, we didn't try to panic. We tried to figure out what to do and we did start to not panic, but like, oh my gosh, what do you do, what do you do? So we wanted to save this little sweet baby bird. So we quick called the animal rescue. They weren't open yet, uh, like wildlife rescue. And then um, the kids had to get to school. They ended up being a little bit late anyway because we were trying to figure out what to do. Anyway, what we decided is we put him on, here, let me turn the camera around so you guys can see and I'll explain what we have going on here. All right, so we put the little baby bird, he's in a bowl. This is a heating pad and we have it on way low. You can see there. And he's on some tissue. And he's laying there and he's doing just fine. He's nice and warm. He did poopies. This but we've had him here for I've had him here for about an hour and a half now. So I am gonna change his bedding, but Katie's coming home from school, so I'm gonna let her do that because she's really good at handling handling little baby animals. But we did some reading up and Katie posted on her story and found that that the baby, uh, we think it's a baby cardinal, by the way. We couldn't figure out what kind of bird it was. There is a, what I assume to be a mama cardinal that keeps, stop, like he keeps, he or she, keeps coming to our front door. And so I think maybe she saw the whole thing go down, which really kind of stinks. So I tried to like follow her to her nest, but those little buggers are fast. So I cannot figure out where the nest is. I'd love to be able to return the baby to the nest, but I cannot find the nest. And the, now the cardinal has stopped coming to the front. So anyway, but we think it's a cardinal. So Katie looked up cardinal on the internet and this baby looks a lot like a baby cardinal. So anywho, um, she looked up what we're supposed to feed them. And in here I have mushed up, I have water mixed with um, cat food mixed with chopped up apples. And I went to the pharmacy and got this little dropper and they said we're supposed to put it in his little mouth behind his windpipe. So I did that when I came home from getting all of this. I had given him some water before I left because he wanted some water. Well, they said he needs water. So all I had was a straw. So I did this and I dropped water into his little baby, baby bird mouth and he loved it. And then I went out and got the dropper and then came back and I fed him. His little mouth was open like this. Ah! And so I fed him right behind his little windpipe, the food. And there he is, he's sleeping now. He took three little, um, three of those, not full, but like three little. So now I'm waiting for Kate to come back home so we can um, move him, change his bedding, and hopefully find a little animal rescue, a little bird rescue where we can take him, or the nest. I mean, I might get my binoculars out and try to find the nest. This little guy, he's so cute. Katie wanted to name him, so she named him Sprinkle. I don't know if it's a boy or girl, but. Sprinkle is perfect. And he's in here in Katie's room. I brought him in here so he could be near the window. And so we could close the door so the kitties wouldn't come in. And so he'd be nice and safe. So I'm going to go ahead and do this right now. Look, I put this over top. So he's feels a little safe and stays nice and warmy warm. But there's enough um, opening so that air can come through for the little guy. Okay, so stay tuned. Find out what's going on with these guys. Um, in the meantime... Ryan is at school. Brennan is in his last week of freshman year, believe it or not. He is going, he's doing his finals, taking his finals now. And what is today? Today is Tuesday. So he has two more days of finals and then he moves out. I can't, I can't believe it. That was so fast. Oh my gosh. And <clears throat> so this, this weekend, our niece Lauren is going to get married. So we're going to North Carolina for her wedding. So Brennan's going to fly up from school to North Carolina to meet us for the wedding and then come home with us for um, the beginning of the summer, which is very exciting. And Katie's been purchasing um, stuff for her dorm room. It's just as soon as Brennan comes back, it's almost like Katie graduates and goes back down. So there's a lot of action going on. There's a lot of busy, a lot of busy. 
All right, I have an update. Um, I think I told you guys that earlier when we first found the baby bird, we called the wildlife sanctuary. Wildlife rescue, like the the local county, and we hadn't heard back, but she just called me back. She gave me a list of one, two, three, four, five different places all across our state that are licensed um, wildlife rehabilitators. So I'm going to start at the top of the list and start to call down and see if I can't find somebody who can take and um, nurture this sweet little baby bird. In the meantime, I'm also going to take the binoculars and try to find the nest. I wish I could ask Alice where it was, but she won't be able to tell me. So Kate's on her way home from school too. So we're going to get this little baby bird taken care of. My bird needs me. Katie's <laughs> home from school. Uh -huh. Is he okay? Yeah. Wait, hold on. I'm going to go in there with you, but look at who's on my lap. The murderer. Oh my gosh. Ah! Right, Alice, I'm going to put you down. I'm going to go visit the little guy. <laughs> Go visit the little guy with Katie here. I'll put you over here. You can sleep right here. Okay, I'll be right back. Isn't he cute? I fed him again. Did I tell you I fed him strawberries? Yeah, what's under his little eye? Oh, what? he's hungry. Okay, oh, talk. Here, want, want, me, want me to do it? Want me to show you how I do it? No, 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 no. Here, yeah. you hold it. You gotta do it fast. Here, you hold this. Okay, I'll do it. Okay, ready? Ready, buddy? Here we go. Do, 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 do. Cool. And he choosy, choosy, choose. Oh, he wants some more. He's like, he's making cool. his little something. Did I not get it in there? Don't choke, bud. Hold can on. You, can, that, there's a little piece on the side. Yeah. Can you, can you, right. can you use the, here. To get it in. Oh. Get it in there. There you go, buddy. Look, his little eyes are open. Okay, hold on. Here you go. Oh, good job, buddy. He's a good eater, isn't he? He is. Well, it's a big it's piece. Big, it's big. Big piece. Hi. Uh... Good job, buddy. Good. Isn't he a good, good eater? Good job. I'm a good eater. He's a good eater. Oops, sorry. Oh, 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 I missed it. I missed it. I missed it. There you go. Get it in there. There you go. Oh, it's a bunch of, a bunch of droppies. Good job, bud. He's such a good, look, he's poopied already too. He's such a good guy. I need you okay. to change his little bedding because you're better at it than me. Because you can pick him up and stuff. There he goes. Here he go. Now he's going to go back to CDs. That's what he does. He just wakes up and eats. Okay, so are we going to take him? Yeah, you ready? Katie's going to check. Oh, 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 goodness sakes. Oh, he wants more food. Yes, he's a good eater. These are strawberries, you guys. I talked to the, um, the lady at the bird rescue and she said, do you have blueberries? And I said, no, but I have strawberries. She said, oh yes, he'll like strawberries. Oh, he's, he's laying down now. Oh, okay, he's good. Okay, I'm gonna stop the film, okay. Okay. All right, so I'm gonna grab him so that we can change his bedding because it's a little bit dirty. Hi, buddy. Come here. Come on, here you go. Okay. Good job, buddy. Good job. Look. This is him. He's doing a good job. Look at him. There you go, bud. You see yourself? Okay, so now we're going to change it out. You look much stronger than you did this morning. Yes, and careful because he does move around. You don't want to drop him. Oh, I won't drop him. Don't. Okay, so I'm going to rip up some toilet paper so he has a little place to sit. Good job, buddy. Hi, sweet sprinkles. I love you. His no, little eyes are open. Sprinkle. Sorry. Sprinkle. Not sprinkles. Sorry. Okay. I'm going to take a Okay, so we changed out his bedding. He's standing up in my hand, which is good because he wasn't doing that this morning. Good job, bud. Oh, there careful. he is. Now he's good. Okay, now we're going to put him he's back in. He's the cutest thing. He's Hi, so buddy. cute. His little eyes are opening, too. He's so, oh, he's you look, a little shaky. You look very oh, strong, he does. buddy. He's, he was moving his legs before. It was so cute. Okay, 
No. You got it. Here you go. Oh, Here you go. On. Oh, you go, what a buddy. good boy. Good job. Or girl. We don't know. But we're calling him a boy. Oh, oh wait. Oh, oh, oh. He's snuggling. <laughs> Here you go. Do you want to snuggle in? It's okay. Good job, buddy. Oh, there you go. You good? Oh, yes. Look how comfy he is. Okay. Okay, now we're going to take him. You ready? Did they say we could feed him applesauce? Okay. So, and when we bring him to the place, I'm going to bring this applesauce and I'm going to bring the eyedropper. And so if he gets hungry on the way, I'll feed him the applesauce through the eyedropper. Okay. And well, do, can we... Or we could cut up strawberries and bring those with us, like the lady said. Okay, we should... Yeah, we should do that. Let's do that. Should, should we not bring the applesauce? Oh, we'll have it just in case we run out of strawberries. Okay. Okay. Should we leave the heat? Yeah, we should. should leave we just... them heated until it's time to go, yeah. Well, are we going now? Yeah. Okay, let's go. Yeah, I'm going to cut some really quick strawberries. Oh, yeah. Okay. okay. All right, Katie and I have baby bird. He's right there in this little... He's sleeping. Thing. He's sleeping. He's going to have a nice little ride. I'll open the... Want me to open the door for you, or do you... can you do it on the no, other side? Okay. 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 to the animal rescue. Look how gorgeous this drive is. Katie's very sad because she thinks that maybe she doesn't want to give him up. Listen to him tweet. He's tweeting. He's doing a very good job of tweeting. This is the thing, Kate. We made him nice and strong and healthy and we saved him this morning from our vicious kitty cat. And he's gonna go grow big and strong and beautiful and be able to play with his friends. Yeah, he's gonna have friends. He's gonna have friends. I see you. Uh oh, where do we go here? Let me see. Okay, well, can I just say our goodbyes? Oh, sorry. Do you want me to go in and get the lady? No. Oh. Okay. I just need a minute. Okay. Depending on we can wake him up. No, you don't want to wake him up. He's sleeping so peacefully. He pooped in Katie's hand on the way over, which means that he's doing well. And he had strawberry seeds in his poop, said Katie, which is really good. That means, oh, sorry. He was eating and digesting, hopefully, the strawberries. He's so happy. We, she was holding him on the way over, and he was sleeping, his little eyes closed, and he just looked like he was smiling. He just looked very happy. And I know it sounds weird, but we said, we said he looks a lot stronger than he did this morning when we got him. You know? Yeah. And he's more fuzzy now and stuff. Look how fuzzy he is. Do you think it might whistle Oh, maybe like a bird? <laughs> he does have a nice little tweet. Okay, sorry. Do you hear the birdies? This is a nice place. You hear all those birds, buddy? Yeah, we're bringing them up. Aww. Okay, Kate, so we found out it's not a cardinal. It was a baby robin. <laughs> so how do you feel? You feel better now, knowing that she's in, or he or she or whatever is in a good place? Yeah. Yeah. You did a good thing, Katie Elizabeth. Yeah. Okay, congratulations. Thanks. You're welcome. We'll say a little prayer for a little baby. Can we go to the, um, the cat place and... Just look at baby kittens. Oh my gosh. We'll want, end up with no, another one. I don't want one. I just want one. All right, we took a pit stop. Like this. Right? We are prom shoe shopping now. Oh, aren't they pretty? The thing is, they're out of Katie's size in almost all of these shoes. So she's going to try a smaller size to see if it works. But they are some pretty nice shoes. Oh, sorry. Thank I guess you should start with those. Yeah. Okay, hold on. Wait till you see these. Those are cutie patootie. Oh, do they fit? Yeah, they're super do you, do you, are your toes smushed in there though? No, they actually feel really nice. Like, okay. They're fancy. I wish my toes were not um, looking like this. Okay, well, we won't show your toes. <laughs> yeah, you should ask. Oh, they're actually like, cute. They're actually look pretty comfy. On the side, oh my gosh, they're so cute. They've got bows on the front. They're silver sparkles. Look at you. Oh, 
They're cute, Kate. They are. They feel cute. They're, do you like walking in them? Yeah, and they look cute too. Like they, they do look cute. I think my feet look cute in them. They do look cute. <laughs> How many times can we say cute more than we say oh, like? <laughs> okay, these are my favorite. A hundred percent, they're my favorite. They're absolutely stunning. I think, but it's not about me. It's about you. Oh my gosh, Kate. I. I wish I could buy those. I love them. Absolutely love them. They're so comfy. Mm-hmm. And cute. Mm-hmm. And I feel like they're not like too like crazy, right. you know? Right. Like the bow ones, it would have to take another like crazy special occasion to wear them again. Exactly. But these, like these, yes. Still a special occasion, but not as crazy. Exactly. <laughs> right. Like you could wear those for a wedding. They're gorgeous. Yeah. Absolutely gorgeous. And they're comfy, which is Good. weird. Oh, I love them. So the good news is that we have an SPCA at the mall. So after going shoe shopping, you can come over and look at kitties. So that's what we're going to do. <laughs> I really should be working. I'm very much procrastinating right now and spending time with well, this is, Kate. Well, this is happiness. And you don't get that much time with me um, once I go to college. So, okay. so I'm getting all of it now. Okay, yeah. perfect. Let's go look at the kitties. Hi, sweet. You look so much like Edward and Alice, doesn't he? Hi. You look so much like Edward and Alice. You are so pretty. He's handsome. You are handsome and pretty. Oh my gosh. Oh, I want to pet you. <gasps> look how much he loves the cat tree, Kate. We let's need to get a cat inside. tree. Okay, let's go inside so we can pet. We're going to pet you. Okay, we visited our kitties. We got a little leash for uh, uh, Edward. Do you think he likes people? Yes, I do. He's very, yes. He's the one that they put in the front because, oh, look. Because he wants to see everybody. Hi, sweet boy. Yeah, we're right here. Hi. Well, hello. Well, hello. He's so cute. His name's Walter. <laughs> I would keep that, too. Okay, we've got to skeet out, okay? Time to go. I for the latest in Live Happy and It's the Donnelly's merchandise, visit shopitsthedonnelly's.com. Thanks for watching. Be sure to thumbs up and subscribe. See you later.